Good morning, my name is Lynn. Today is May 9th, 2023. Today is week two, day two. It was right for me. Oh, today for lunch we're having chicken nuggets. Tomorrow for breakfast, it's Cheerios. Bye! Good morning, Meadow Lake Eagles. It is Trivia Tuesday. Today's question is, how many pairs of wings does a bee have? Lots of bees flying around. How many pairs of wings? Remember, pair means two. So how many pairs of wings does a bee have? Do you give up? The answer is two. So two pairs, two times two, two plus two, four wings total. So two pairs of wings, four wings total. Have a great Tuesday. We'll see you tomorrow. Hello, I'm Mr. Burt. I want you to know that I went to De La Salle High School briefly for half of my high school career, and then I graduated from Eastview. College was my next step, which is a very important part of your life. Um, I went to two universities, but I finished out at Fresno Pacific in California. I've lived in four different countries, Iceland, Spain, Germany, and Italy. I was able to live in these countries because I played basketball. I've played four seasons of, seasons of professional basketball um, abroad uh, in Europe, and it's been one of the best experiences of my life. Uh, but it's also a lot of hard work. It's not just something easy to do. So make sure you're focused, study hard, and work so you can accomplish your dreams, and I'll see you out at recess. Are you happy? Are you sad? Are you excited? Are you mad? Are you anxious? Are you glad? Let's talk about the sounds of regulation. Are you happy? Are you sad? Are you excited? Are you mad? Are you anxious? Are you glad? Let's talk about the sounds of regulation. Hey, Metal Lake. It's Miss Hanson Burke, and I'm here with Zach and Zach from fourth grade, and we're going to do a summary of a lot of the strategies that we learned for zones of regulation this year. So if you're in a zone you don't want to be in and you want to take it to a different zone, here's some ways to do it. You can take three breaths. Talk about your feelings. Listen to music. Ask for help. Take a break. Take a break. <sighs> a breath. He meant take a breath. Think calming thoughts. And that's it. Those are some of the st strategies that we've learned this year about how to regulate our zones. Thank you and have a great summer. Bye. Bye. Are you happy? Are you sad? Are you excited? Are you mad? Are you anxious? Are you glad? Let's talk about the sounds of regulation. Are you happy? Are you sad? Are you excited? Are you mad? Are you anxious? Are you glad? Let's talk about the sounds of regulation. Boys and girls, we have a rap that we say on Tuesdays. Say it with me. Meadow Lake is the school and kindness is the tool. We work hard every day to show the rod and steel way. I'm respectful, responsible, and a bucket filler too. We care for one another the entire school year through. We are learning all the standards so we can lead the way. Meadow Lake defines excellence every single day. Hey, Meadow Lakers, it's Principal Lacey here, and I am reminding you that it is Teacher Appreciation Week. That's right, Teacher Appreciation Week. Make sure you show your teachers how much you appreciate them. And I have an idea for you of how to do that. First of all, being respectful. Our first B, be respectful. If you say please and thank you to your teacher and in your classroom, to each other, to your peers, that is being respectful. And that is one way to appreciate your teacher. Also, greeting your teacher or other adults or anyone who says good morning, if you say good morning, they will really, really appreciate it. That is, that are, that's two ways that you can show um, that you appreciate your teacher. Have a great day. Hey friends, it's Miss Withers. 
let's take our four big deep breaths with this springtime breathing pathway. Let's plant our feet flat on the ground and get ourselves centered so we can feel calm together. Are you ready? Okay, take a deep breath in and out. And in and out. And in and out. And one last deep one in and out. I'll talk to you later. Bye.